Well, here's an interesting little exercise that we're going to do. Um, I've got a catalogue of 53 full site editing themes here, of which 44 of them are available from WordPress.org. And what I want to do is find out how many patterns each of these things deliver. Now, most of them deliver the patterns with uh, PHP, and therefore it's not easy to actually go and find out what what they contain. So what I have written is a piece of logic that will sort of preview the theme and at the same time it will start, load up the patterns and then export them into a, a cache in the languages folder of the patterns that have been documented. Um, we're going to go through each of the 53 themes and as we go through it we'll see the basically the theme will change to the theme which we're clicking on so here we're going to click on the theme called i know and lo and behold we're now displaying the same output as we saw before the theme summary and this time we can see there's 51 patterns and this is what i know looks like we're going to do the same for alara Alara, 48, that's 99 so far patterns. Amando, 28 patterns. I'm pronouncing these things right. Oh, look at that. That's got the title twisted around the left, isn't that fancy? Bye, no patterns in my block base Bosco. Zero. Block base itself. Different thing. Block base is a parent theme and there's quite a few different themes that are child of that you'll see later on 15 brixy see most of them have got the sort of same sort of header sometimes they're using the for the menu they're just using the page list which all looks a bit funny and so look and then they have whatever they want to do and then they produce a footer and many of the patterns say proudly powered by wordpress well, that's what I've noticed so far. Ceres must be a child theme or something. So how come it doesn't deliver any? Maybe I've not got the template for it defined correctly. It's Clove. Big header. Ooh. No surprise there for empty theme, it's not dialed. Now Marston's an interesting one. I keep I got that message before, don't know why. Created it. This is my theme fizzy. So it looks exactly the same as it did. No surprise. Brand new theme created today. Child theme of Alara from Waz. FSE tutorial. Geologist based on block base. It's one of those dark ones. Gutina. Hansen, have you been keeping count of how many there are? Ooh. Chase now Will Kubrick two display a page. Nope. Where are we now? Oh, right. So this is a, another version of the theme summary. Let's get back to where we were supposed to be.
them all. There you are, doesn't like PHP eight, I suppose. Oh no, and a minimal pacer. As you can see, some of these themes are really quite small with regards to the number of templates, template parts they deliver. They've all got a variety of different widths, haven't they? Oh, then expand my short coats. Rick. Seal it blocks. Narrow. Stuart, fairly new one. Not in red. No. This is my mine. Right. Tuva, Tuva. Reminds me of Moomins. Don't move. TT1 blocks. Yeah, 2021, the block version of it. Twenty nineteen blocks. This is also a uh, what are they called? An experimental one from WordPress experiment theme experiments. Twenty twenty blocks. Ooh. No, is that the code that's not updated? I think so. Well that message says you're supposed to make code changes to change query loop to post template to it doesn't tell you it's supposed to be core slash post template. Where are we going to? 2021. 2022, a brand new theme available today in WordPress.org. It's going to be packaged up at about four o'clock. Here we go. There's 2022 blocks, 66 of them. Video maker based on block base. Dark theme. We code art. Now this one provides uh, HTML templates. Interestingly, like my themes. But as we can see, we're getting some messages. Ooh. Interesting fixed header. Wow, more. What's happening here? It's just displaying index. WP draft. Hmm. Does no work. Zelia. 
child theme of Alara. And the last one, zoologist. There you go. So if we now go back to get rid of that. There we go, we can see we've gone through and cached all of the different patterns so that when you go and visit a website and you want to have a look at there. When you want to go and visit a theme and you want to have a look at their patterns, you can click on it here like that. And this the templates, which were displayed in the HTML form for the template. So we can see, let's go back to the 404, we can see the template part header is used and then it's got template part footer and within that there is a group block which actually displays a pattern. We come to template parts, you can see footer, it displays a pattern and the header. Maybe it doesn't. Now if we go and look at the patterns. We can see the default footer is for the 2022 theme, says WordPress blocks. No, it doesn't. It says that's the title of the site and it says proudly powered by WordPress, the link to WordPress.org. Let's go and have a look at the header. Mm. Maybe I should sort them. There's a header, and let's have a look at the hidden Am I on the right theme? Still in 2022, I thought there was a hidden thing. Go back to the templates. 404, 2022, hidden 404. There you go. So it's hidden 404 and the title is 404 content. So maybe I need to title this bit to the name of inside the title. That would be a good idea, wouldn't it? All right then, let's finish recording that. Bye.